I'm Anil Kumar. In this series, we have taken a few interesting examples on mean and median. Here is another excellent question. Average cost of five books is $1.20. The median is 19. Most expensive book costs $1.24 and the cheapest one is of $1.17. Find possible cost of other two books. Right, that's the question for you. You can pause the video, understand the question, answer, and then look into my suggestions. Let's read the question once again. Average cost of five books is 20. So we are working with five books. Let's say one, two, three, four, five. We are working with five books. And what are we given? Average cost of five books is 20, right? So average cost which is also mean correct average cost is also mean average cost is dollar 20 right so if average cost is dollar 20 for five books what is the total cost can you tell me of five books total cost should be dollar 20 times 5 right since the average cost is dollar 20 so that gives you a value of hundred dollars is it okay so hundred dollars is the total cost so that is the information which we get from the first sentence do you see that average cost of five books is twenty dollars that means that mean or average cost is twenty dollars total cost of five books should be five times twenty which is hundred dollars okay what else is given median is 19 now what is median median is the center value right so median is the center value which is 19 so this is 19 for us most expensive book cost 24 that is the most expensive let us arrange them in increasing order cheapest is 17 dollars find the possible cost of other two that is the question for you I hope you understand and appreciate the question now. You can always pause the video, answer, and then look into my suggestions. Now, it is very interesting. So we could have uh, many combinations. Since I'm saying that I've arranged them in increasing order, let me assume this cost to be 18, right? So let's start by placing some value, right? So I will take this cost as 18 and then calculate. If I say the cost of this book is 18, what is that cost? Let us calculate. Total is 100. Is it okay? Total is 100. So in this particular case, it should be, uh, this cost should be 100. Take away the sum of all these. That is 17 plus 18 plus 19 plus 24, right? That should be the cost of this book, right? So let's calculate this. Or we can just straight away 100 take away 17 right take away 18 take away 19 and take away 24 we get 22 so 22 is the cost of this book so so one combination could be 18 and 22 so this set right is one combination so let me write down this set so cost of five books will be 17 18 19 22 and 24 do you get it right but what we could do is we could take this value as uh, as 19 also right so we could also take this value as 19 in that case since I've taken this one more this should be one less so this should be 21 so we could get another combination which is 17 19 19 21 24 you get an idea right well, I could have taken this cost as 17 also, right? Why 19, 17 also, right? In that case, if I take one less than 18, then this will be one more than 22. I'll get this as 23. So another combination, which is 17, 17, 19, 23, and 24 also works. Do you see that? So these are three possible answers. Do you see that? So the cost of those books could be, we could have this combination. I'm Anil Kumar and I hope you appreciate the method by which we have solved this question. 
You can always share and subscribe my videos. Thank you and all the best.